Hello everyone, welcome to my project schedule with gun charts in Excel tutorial. So let's begin. So here in Excel, we're going to create a tabulation for our schedule. So let's proceed. Here we were going to have a project project package then description we already have our tabulation so item 1 we have preliminaries roads and parking the cost of our preliminaries let's say see four million nine nine hundred thirty one thousand two hundred eighty then our last is parking two million two hundred ninety six thousand 599.04% So we have already our activities and its cost We're going to input our start end and duration Here we're going to include our start date September 16 of 2021 and our project have a duration of 8 months 240 days so our end is start date plus 240 duration minus 1 that is May 13, 2022 then our last is roads and parking let's just see uh, March 16 2022 and we have a duration of 92 so just copy this one so we have to compute for our weighted percentage of our activities so let's uh, sum up our cost here drag it to the first activity so now we have our total cost compute our weighted percentage which is uh, the cost of the activity divided by the total cost of the project So our weighted percent of the activity preliminaries is 12.33. Continue. So finally, we are already have everything that we need. We have the cost, the weighted percentage, the duration of our activities. We have the start and the end. This is a necessary data for our gun chart. So let's proceed. To our uh, gun chart so here we're going to create our days September 16 will be on Thursday then next Friday then just drag this to 
so it will populate the days we have our date so just put this equals to our start then place another one here next day just place equals the date plus one day that is on September 17 copy this one then you're going to paste it so there you have already your date this is also a data that we need for our gun chart so we we're going to create our gun chart so let's proceed so we will make our formula here c equals if close parenthesis and we have another logical expression and so let's check if this is true this date greater than or equals to our start comma same date lesser than or equal to our end date close parenthesis if it's true the value should be weighted percentage divided by duration if false value should be zero there so that is our formula now we're going to customize this formula so if we copy the in, in other cells it will not move so let's put dollar signs on 9 this one as well then for our start date and end date it's place assigned at the letters there there and as well our if true values Now, next step is you have already sell this sale you have to put a conditional formatting new rules then take this format only sales that contains not equal to then just put zero here value then format our sales color fill effect then I want a bit darker then this one uh, darker at the center okay okay that is the formatting of our cell we will just make this a little smaller and maybe that size is good let's see there it's very small but it will do and copy this cell that has a formula then paste it all over your activities Control B. So, as you would see, you have already your gun chart. And next, what we're going to do is to clear this up. It 
it's a it's better if you have the grid but it is very tedious to do and it will consume time so we will just put no borders there finally we have just have a solid border see you have already your gun check so that's it that would be your gun check hide this one so if you like also primavera management scheduling just check at the link and don't forget to subscribe comments likes and share bye